COVID-19 was surely a setback to victims trying to recover from the deadly March 3rd tornadoes. And as News Channel 5's Matthew Torres shows us, the pandemic put an effort by Metro students to restore memories for those families to a standstill. In this Mount Juliet neighborhood, progress has been slow. John Clore wants to see it speed up. We're at a place now where we're just saying, you know what, let's just hopefully be, be done with this. Six months since a deadly tornado in Wilson County, the home he sold just days before remains untouched because of insurance. But he's pivoting to make sure his family is okay. We've started some therapy. We all we need to all get in, but we've at least begun some of it. He's using this moment as a snapshot of what could have been. We still have the original. Even if that's holding on to precious memories that were swept away. Like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad I still, still have it. This father managed to save dozens of pictures, several of them with damage. One thing to repair a house, of course, that's another thing when you, when you can hang on to these. This one was really water damaged and also had paint spilled on. Metro Schools teacher Brina Harmoning is making sure his family gets to keep that moment. In March, she started a project with her students to collect, clean and scan damaged pictures and restore them through Photoshop. I wanted the students to learn a selfless act and to do something for the community. But progress stalled quickly thanks to COVID-19. Not everyone has access to the program from home. One picture alone could take up to two hours to fix. Copy the shadows from the side of her nose over here. With pictures stored in folders, she's ready to start again once kids return to school. It was very intimate looking at their pictures. I feel like I know their family. Like I'm like, I want to hang out with their son and their grandkid. These are our two sons, Harvey and Charlie. There are still many things to work through, but Clore says this project to bring life back to pictures captures the kindness in others. People not forgetting and so when you come back around, it means more than I know how to say. Matthew Torres, News Channel 5.